a series of bombings outside the U.S. Embassy in Sana'a, Yemen, with as many as five explosions rocking the compound, killing at least 16 people. A U.S. official says the attacks appeared carefully planned. Yemeni authorities first responding to the scene were ambushed by snipers. The attack bears all the hallmarks of an al-Qaeda attack, where you have multiple vehicle-borne devices uh, along with um, personnel on foot, it, seemingly um, in an attempt to try to breach the perimeter and actually get inside. All American personnel are safe. One locally employed embassy security guard was killed, along with Yemeni troops stationed there and some of the attackers. The compound, seen here in file footage, has been targeted before. It appears some of the attackers were dressed as soldiers, armed with automatic weapons, rocket-propelled grenades, and at least one car bomb. This witness says there was an exchange of machine gun fire, then a big explosion, followed by more gunfire and explosions in other areas. Yemen is the ancestral home of Osama bin Laden and has struggled to put down al-Qaeda-linked Islamic militants. One objective of these extremists is they kill, is to try to cause the United States to lose our nerve. The White House condemns the attack and says it is a reminder of the continuing threat from violent extremists, both at home and abroad. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.